To be a quarterback for the Vols is not only an honor, it's a challenge very few have been qualified to handle. Leading a Tennessee football team is never an easy task, especially on the road. With a combined road record of 35-9, and nine, star quarterbacks Peyton Manning and Casey Clawson have shaped the mold and legacy of the quarterback position at UT. Now tasked with leading Team 117 on their first road game, quarterback Justin Worley has quite the responsibility ahead of him. Justin Worley says one of the keys to a victory this weekend is understanding and executing the offensive schemes. I think as an offense we need to be able to uh, take control of the game, be able to stay on the field and help our defense out. And uh, if they start putting up points, not worry about what they're doing, only control what, what we can control. Mental toughness and good communication are two things Justin Worley has shown this week, says coach Mike Bajakian. We, we've thrown a lot at him this week in terms of preparing for our opponent, but also as is typically the case for road games, we have all kinds of crowd noise going on in practice. We've, uh, we, we've made the environment one that in which he can't hear. So he's had a good week of practice. Our communication has been, uh, has been efficient, and, and I'm excited to see how he does this week. In preparation for Oregon, Coach Bajakian has praised Justin Worley for continually improving his leadership this week. He needs to be the alpha male. We talk a lot about that as a quarterback group in, in, in terms of leadership. He has to step up and, and be a presence with the entire offense. It's a little more difficult because obviously on the field it's harder for, him, for, harder for his teammates to hear him, uh, but he's just got to have that presence, that command presence and own the line for him, like to say. Tennessee looks to improve to a 3-0 record this weekend. Justin Worley is ready to lead the Vols to Eugene to take on a highly talented Oregon team. For Vol Report, I'm Sarah Mitchell.